against our will. The Red Terror had returned to our land. My dearest Neole, I dreamt last night I was hiking across a muddy field with my comrades. We were now partisans. In this time, in this hour, I have been partisan. Yes. By that you mean Lithuanian underground yes. resistance. Yes. Many of these young people did not expect uh, the Soviet occupation to last uh, a very long time. I believe this was a hopeless fight, but fight of undefeated nation. They provided a model of the importance of being Lithuanian. And it was that, that image, that understanding, that helped inform the national movement in 1989. We believed that freedom would dawn once more. For them, freedom was more important than life. Their bodies and body parts would be collected from the battlefield. When their hearts, their spirits knew that they are going probably to die. Jokingly, he always used to call Lithuania his first wife and me his second wife. You know, Neon, this struggle is not possible without bloodshed, but the Iron Curtain of our enemies will be defeated. Please, Neon, make me happy and start a new and happy life. The inspiring true story of the Invisible Front. Soviet occupation, terror, and war did not destroy their faith in freedom. Audience Award winner, Vilnius Film Festival. Opens in select theaters this November.